Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my channel. This is Tanush and uh, today we'll be discussing about uh, the transit of Saturn in 2023 for Libra Ascendant because Libra Ascendant guys are going to have a wonderful time uh, you know uh, due to the transit of Saturn right now this sign of Libra is very very important and it is a sign where Saturn actually gets exalted right so uh, Libra sign or Tula Rashi represents balancing of energies uh, it represents you know balancing of relationship and that is why uh, Saturn likes to be in the sign of Libra because Saturn likes the sign which is actually balanced and hence you know Saturn uh, likes the sign of Libra very much and is exalted in the sign of Libra now Saturn also becomes the Yoga Karaka planet for Libra ascendant because it rules uh, one Trikona house and one Kendra house meaning the house uh, four and fifth fourth and fifth house both important houses are ruled by Saturn and hence it becomes one of the important planet for uh, I mean uh, yeah for the Libra ascendant guys now for past almost like you know two and a half years Saturn was in your fourth house and if you were uh, Libra moon then it was it is considered a kind of dhaya but things were not so bad for uh, Libra ascendant guys things were were much better and if you guys were running Saturn Mahadasha and uh, you know Saturn was you know uh, placed or is placed uh, in a relatively okay sign then you might have purchased you know some property surely right so now on 17th of January Saturn is going to transit into your fifth house and this transit is also very very important for you guys because like I discussed in my previous video any transit of Saturn becomes a very important event for everyone because Saturn uh, changes sign every two and a half years and it comes back to the same sign after say 30 years and hence we discuss generally you know the transit of Saturn and Saturn being a slow moving planet it has the capability of slowing down our life you know uh, many uh, aspects of our life significantly if it is badly placed but for Libra ascendant guys as I said it is a yoga karaka planet and uh, its transit to a fifth house is surely going to be a good one now what can we expect uh, fifth house represents children right so let's talk about that so suppose you are planning for children then I would say this is the best time for you to you know go for children so you can have children and uh, you know things would be quite smooth during this period uh, fifth house also represents education or you know uh, even higher learning they say uh, of course we need to see the ninth house as well but fifth house surely represents education and many good things so if you were planning uh, to uh, go for higher education uh, learn some new things get into a new space you know like you know changing of domain changing of your uh, line of work changing of your professional path you know this is going to be a very very significant uh, transit for you guys because Saturn represents all these things right so uh, if you are planning and if you are student then it's going to be a wonderful time now from fifth house it also aspects the eleventh house of hopes and wishes and uh, looking at the uh, you know the transit of Jupiter so I'll talk about that after some time uh, the, the next transit of Jupiter will also aspect your 11th house so if you are planning to travel to any foreign places for uh, say job or for higher education then this is going to be a wonderful time for you guys so you know utilize this time properly now if you are into say share market or speculation uh, any sort of speculation uh, business or speculation industry then you know uh, because Saturn is coming in the fifth house and aspecting the eleventh house and in the month of April 2023 Jupiter would be transiting to a seventh house and also aspecting your eleventh house so you will get wonderful gains you know from speculation specially and uh, if you are into that business then you can plan for it and if your Saturn is uh, you know situated in a very good house then probably you can invest in shares during this you know next two two and a half years you can consider investing in shares and they would yield a wonderful result for you you know uh, 
in next two two and a half years right now uh, jupiter right now is in your sixth house but in the month of april 2023 when jupiter transits to the sign of aries it would come to a seventh house right and people who are looking out for marriage it's going to be a wonderful time for you because saturn is would be sitting in the fifth house so fifth house is also very important for marriage uh, and especially if you guys are involved in some love affairs and you know you are looking for some sort of uh, love marriage so this may not make sense for the western people but you know for the asian people especially uh, if you are planning for uh, love marriage then you know it would be a wonderful time you can uh, talk to your family and you know things would turn out to be very positive right uh wonderful time for marriage because uh, jupiter is in your 7th uh, house jupiter is going to aspect your 11th house and saturn is also saturn which is a lot of your 5th house is also going to aspect your 11th house so you know, a wonderful time for marriage right now uh jupiter also aspects your 2nd house so 2nd house represents family right so uh, the aspect of saturn on your second house implies that there may be an growth in your family meaning uh, if you are expecting children or you know if one of your family member like your son or your brother your spa, you know someone is expecting children then you know uh, there would be an addition to the family sure surely and if someone is uh, attained the age of marriage and is desiring to get marriage then that is also possible because that also indicates you know addition to the family right now uh, second house also represents the house of wealth so saturn would actually help you to uh, invest in the proper direction invest in the proper uh, you know shares or uh, proper place where you would actually yield wonderful returns because saturn is also aspecting your 11th house and second house so both the house of wealth are being aspected by saturn and any investment done during this period you know would yield wonderful returns for you guys right and uh, jupiter when it is going to transit uh, so right now it's in the 6th house uh, it's aspecting uh, so it's in its own sign and it is aspecting your 10th house which is also wonderful so um, if you have plans for job change then this jupiter in the 6th house would actually help you to get that you know that wonderful job uh so you can try that in between uh january and april 15 so that would be an ideal time for any job change so uh, start looking out for opportunities and you'll surely get a wonderful you know job which you were desiring from long time right so uh, so guys these were my thoughts on uh, the next transit of saturn and like i said uh, this transit is very very important for gemini uh, ascendant because Saturn is the lord of their ninth house, the lord of their bhagya. It is very important for Taurus ascendant or Vrishab lagna because it becomes again the yogkara ka planet for them, the lord of their ninth and tenth house, and it is also equally important for Libra ascendant because Saturn is the best friend of your ascendant. Not only that, uh, it, it 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 gets exalted in the uh, in the sign of Libra, and it's a yogkara ka planet for you, meaning it's a lord of uh, one of the important. Uh, kendra and trikona house meaning the house uh, fourth and fifth right so utilize this time like i said the transit of saturn is quite rare probably we see we might see trans uh, you know uh, saturn coming in the same sign probably twice in our lifetime or maybe three times if you are lucky so uh, very important transit i would say so utilize the time properly and you know you'll achieve great things thank you so much for watching so i am considering uh, doing uh, videos for other ascendant as well because i've got many comments i surely will do that so i'll i'll i'll, I'll surely try to do that probably you know uh, in this week thank you so much guys for watching if you like my video please subscribe to my channel i'll be back with another video thank you